Continues our team coverage tonight. Blake, people were packed in front of the Fulton County Jail awaiting Young Thug's release. Sean, excitement was in the air tonight as family and friends gathered here waiting for Young Thug's release. Now, they weren't able to see the rapper released as he was discreetly driven out of the Fulton County Jail. Rick here getting driven with his attorney. Now, what we can confirm is he is now a free man for the first time in two and a half years. The 33 year old had been behind bars since May of 2022, spending over 900 days in custody. We were here as the crowd gathered, ready to greet him in his first moments of freedom, although they were eventually told that Young Thug had already been released. His lawyer, Brian Steele, described in detail what life had been like for his client behind bars. Nobody here wakes up every day on a concrete floor that they're calling his bed, gets up at 415, gets shackled at his feet, his waist, and his hands. As part of his plea deal, Young Thug could end up back in jail if he violates any of his probation. Reporting live outside the Fulton County Jail, Blake Devine, Atlanta News First. Now, today's plea deal does not signal the end of the YSL trial. The fate of two more co-defendants remains undecided. Diamante Kendrick and Shannon Stillwell are each pushing for this trial to continue. Atlanta News First spoke with Suri Chata Jimenez, the defense attorney who represented one of the original defendants. He laid out the rough legal road ahead for both men. It is going to be challenging for them. The two remaining people are charged with very serious crimes. I mean, Mr. Stillwell is charged with a murder. He could be facing uh, life. He could die in prison. I am hoping that they will offer him something reasonable for him to be able to evaluate his options and get to go home eventually. The Atlanta News Source app has complete coverage on this breaking news, including a timeline highlighting the major moments in this case. You can scan the QR code. It's on the left side of your screen to download it and get those developments sent directly to your smartphone.